this is Hannah Fletcher with News TV. Today we are joined by just a few of the cast members of the brand new series, With Love. How are you guys today? How are you guys feeling? Great, Hannah. Thanks for yeah, having great, us. Great, Hannah. Thanks for having us. Of course, it's my pleasure. My first question to you guys is, how do you feel knowing that this series is going to be released into the world in such a short amount of time? How are you guys feeling in general? Oh, I'm so ready for it. Mark, you ready for it? Let's yeah. do this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm really, I mean, I'm really excited. I think that, uh, you know, uh, during pandemic, shooting this show was a really big joy for all of us um, to stay busy and uh, have the privilege of working in the middle of a global pandemic. I think that as actors, that is a huge gift. And um, we're really excited for the world to see, you know, what, what we came up yeah, with. Yeah, it was, I mean, I mean, those two months that like, came at a certain time for me during the pandemic were like, it was just really hard, you know, and, and it felt good knowing that we were doing, we were, we were a part of a story that, that Gloria, our creator and showrunner, Gloria Calderon Kelly, like her intention was to put something out in the world that people would, would love and that would heal them, especially after what we've all been going through, you know, so, so this, this, this show is kind of like a love letter you know, to, to, to everyone after what, what we've been going through for the last two years. Um, and of course, because it's Gloria, you know, she, she has to, she has to break that new, she has to break that new ground, break, break, break tropes and, and represent all these, you know, communities that, that are underrepresented. And she did it so beautifully. And, and that's why we're so excited for December 17th, all five episodes, you guys are going to get it and it's going to be awesome. Definitely. You mentioned about breaking tropes and having a wide array of representation that is finally being shown that has been much needed to be shown. How does it feel as people and as actors to be a part of such a beautiful, progressive project like this? I mean, I, I my, my audition scene was, was that holiday scene, Mark, where, we, where I have to explain uh, <laughs> My, my sexuality to your family, mm -hmm. <laughs> which is like something that uh, as a Filipino dude, that would never happen. <laughs> I mean, maybe now, I don't know. Like Mark, I feel like our show could inspire some conversations this holiday sure. season throughout the, the you know, really? 2022. Um, yeah, it just, it meant so much to me. Like, like it was, it, it was as, you know, I'm, I'm a Philippine, I'm a gay Filipino who, who, who lives in Ali, you know, Los Angeles and to to see these characters existing in you know our story takes place in Portland but just to see the representation all across the board from the Latino community the black community the Latinx community the a a API community um uh because Desmond Chum is on our show and he, he plays a Chinese character and I play a Filipino character it's just we don't see this and we don't see like the depiction of love um you know through the lens of like one the holidays Two, focus on a Latino family. Three, with a super diverse cast. Four, like with the representation of the LGBTQ trans queer community, like I don't know any other show that's really showing this group of people, this recipe, if you will, in this light of like joy of, uh, you know, community, family, and um, like all the different kinds of love that you can have. Mm -hmm. from no matter what community you belong to. I think that's just such a huge gift for us right now. Well, and the holidays are just in general a really stressful time for everyone. Yeah. So yeah. I think that, um, <laughs> you know, um, besides that. the kind of intellectual um, uh, analysis of the show, you know, that the holidays are a really stressful time for people. So this will bring them some joy, I think. Sure. I think so too. You guys did such a wonderful job and I just want to thank you both for taking the time to speak with us today. I'm wishing you, a, first of all, a happy holidays and all of the most success, all of the good vibes. You guys did a great job. I'm definitely a fan of the show myself and I will be keeping an eye on things. So congratulations. Thank you, Hannah. Thanks a lot, Hannah. Bye guys. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Take care.